Okay, now we're gonna do a tap block, since this lady's having a mommy makeover, consisting of breast augmentation with a silicone gel implant and an abdominoplasty. So if we look at the musculature of the anterior abdominal wall, this would be the lateral border of the rectus, that's the plica semilunaris, and then these three muscles start to separate. And where we wanna go is in the space between the tap plane, which is between the transverse salus and the internal oblique. And the internal oblique is always the largest of the three muscles. So there's my view. I've got a nice view of all three muscles. And for this, we're gonna use a mixture of 20 cc's of saline, 20 cc's of Marcaine half percent, and 20 cc's of Expra. So now I'm just following the needle down, and there I popped in, give me a test dose. And there's the space between the two. Okay, switch over to the ropivacaine. Expirel, I mean. Expirel Marcaine. Okay, and there's the, the muscles kind of separating right there. That's perfect. That's exactly what you want to see. Yeah, they're just separating away. And the, you can see the transversalis being pushed down and the internal domino oblique being pushed upward and the expirel Marcaine mixture just separating the two. So we're going to put easy. It's going in easy. Mm -hmm. We put 15 cc's of that on each side. Okay, that's one side. So now we're going to do a tap block on the opposite side. So again, I've got, this is in Pettit's triangle between the costal margin and the anterior superior iliac spine. It's usually just uh, in front of the line of the anterior axillary line or wherever the muscles look like they're the most separated. Just above the umbilicus is usually where this is going in. So I'm gonna go in perpendicular to the skin. I'm gonna find the needle. I'm already through the internal because she's so thin. See, I'm pushing on the, that, that little plane. I think I'm in, give me a test dose. Perfect, okay, switch over. And they're usually, they're not that fast, but you know, 10 seconds is pretty fast but usually it's about 35, 40 seconds to do. And there you can see it splitting and separating the muscles. And the patients get such good pain relief from this. And we reserve, uh, because it's a 60 cc mixture, so I'll reserve 10 cc's, five from each side, to directly infiltrate the area where we close the diastasis above the umbilicus. And with that, they get really good pain relief. They're in the PACU for an hour where they used to be in there for three and four hours with a mommy makeover. And you can see here that here's the fluid. You can see the internal oblique being pushed upward and the transverse salus being pushed downward. And that's it. Thank you very much.